ain't no room for the hopeless sinner who'd hurt all mankind just to save his own. Maybe better put in the deep dead feet as in the kingdom's throne. Men, get ready, get ready, yeah, you better get ready. Soon Jesus, soon Jesus, soon Jesus, soon. Get ready, get ready, yeah, you better get ready. Soon, Jesus, soon, Jesus, soon, Jesus, soon. Now, I kind of messed that up, so I'm going to read it now, that second verse. There ain't no room for the hopeless sinner could hurt all mankind just to save his own. Have pity on those whose chances grow thinner. There's no hiding place from the kingdom's throne. Get ready, get ready, yeah, you better get ready. Soon, Jesus, soon, Jesus, soon, Jesus, soon. Get ready, get ready, you better get ready. Soon, Jesus, soon, Jesus, soon, Jesus, soon. People get ready for the train to glory. Picking up passengers from coast to coast. Faith is the key, just believe and you can board it. There's room for all who love the Holy Ghost. Get ready, get ready, yeah, you better be ready. Soon, Jesus, soon, Jesus, soon, Jesus, soon, yeah. Get ready, get ready, yeah, you better get ready. Soon, Jesus, soon, Jesus, soon, Jesus, soon. Come on, soon Jesus, soon Jesus, soon Jesus, soon Jesus, soon Jesus. Everybody sing that one time. Soon Jesus, soon Jesus, soon Jesus, soon. Hey, you all sounding pretty good. Give yourself a hand there. I heard some of you were singing the words with me. That was pretty good. Uh, this next song I, uh, I wrote uh, for my grandkids. Uh, I'm going to call them up here in just a minute. But first I want to call up a man that uh, I've grown to uh, respect more and more since the day he was born. Uh, I've seen greatness in him. And that's my son who is a father in his own right, Asaph. Would you come up and help me on the guitar with this one time? I'm going to sing it through one time. Then I'm going to have the grandkids come up and do it with me, too. I, I, I don't know it too well. This is the first time you've ever, it's ever been done in public. It's, it's called Many Are Called. And it goes something like this. Eden, where the covenant was broken, kicked out of the garden, and I knew he wasn't joking. It wasn't long before man began to croak, but the Creator made a promise with the word that he had spoken. God sent a lot of people who were really gifted, then he sent his only son who offered to be lifted. The devil did his worst, but Jesus couldn't be sifted, so when they nailed him to the cross, the paradigm got sifted. Many are called, but few are chosen. Many are called, but few are chosen. Many are called, but few are chosen. Choose me, oh Lord, choose me. Going to church is more than just driving in for takeout. Watching and praying is really something like a stakeout. Jesus is the way of kicking that stinking snake out. When we finally get it together, revival's gonna break out. Many are called. But few are chosen, many are called, but few are chosen, many are called, but few are chosen, choose me, oh Lord, choose me. So if you're, so if you're frozen, 
than your bed or best chosen. Seek his face, pray for grace. Gotta get more than just your toes in. Choose life, get right, be a vessel Jesus glows in. Be assured by his word and a Holy Ghost explosion. Many are called, but few are chosen. Yeah, many are called, but few are chosen. Come on up here, kids. That few are chosen. Choose me, oh Lord, choose me. Choose. Did you want to sing this with me or do you want to dance to? Hello, everybody. Can you hear them okay? All right, all right, here we go. It was Eden where the covenant was broken, kicked out of the garden. God sent a lot of people who were really gifted, that he sent his only son who walked for to be lifted. The devil did his worst, but Jesus could receive it. So the world is across the paradigm shifting. Many are called, but few are chosen. Many are called, but few are chosen. Many are called, but few are chosen. Going to church, church is more than just driving a different ticket. Watching that prayer is really something like a stick out. Jesus is a way of kicking that sinker's neck out. When you finally get it together, revival's gonna break out. Jesus is a way of kicking that sinker's neck out. When you finally get it together, revival's gonna break out. Many are called, but few are chosen. Many are called, but few are chosen. Many are called, but few are chosen. very much <laughs> I have one one tiny story that I was thinking of uh, that about Ace when Asaph when uh, he was growing up he was actually their age I think he was uh, he and his brother were six and seven and um, we homeschooled them my wife did 98% of the work but I did uh, some of their other uh, little extracurricular activities with them and one time I thought you know I need to give them some kind of discipline and I thought some kind of military discipline would be good so I just uh, devised this little game called Captain Dad right so I was Captain Dad of course and I decided well I'm gonna talk to him start talking to him like a drill sergeant you know here's what we're gonna do we're gonna take our guns they had BB guns at the time I had a little 22 you know and uh, uh, teaching them gun safety and everything and we're gonna we have a mission now. We're going to go around the house. We're going to shoot the snot out of that pumpkin back there. I had thrown a rotten pumpkin back in the house. It was like early December and October was well over. And, and I said, and you go first and you go second. And I'm, I'm giving them orders, right? And Ace says to me, Dad, how come you're being so mean? <laughs> and you know what? It made me feel great because I realized that 
Even though I was just pretending to be a sergeant, I wasn't always talking mean to him. Otherwise, he would have told me, you know, that was kind of cool. I like that. And um, so we ran around the house, you know, to shoot this pumpkin, <laughs> which we did, by the way. And I saw a car going by on one of our neighbors in an old truck, and he sees three guys in military fatigues. We all had our camo outfits with guns running around the house. <laughs> so I'm thinking, He's going to call the <laughs> Sure enough, we made our way around the house after shooting up the pumpkin, and a patrol car goes drifting by, and he sees me with the kids out there, and he says, ah, oh, okay, and he did it just right. That's my dad's day story for today. Thank you very much for putting up with us. Thank you, son, for putting up with me. And you guys, we're still putting up with you because we love you. God bless you. Thank you, Pastor Howard.